Hello everybody, it's Jen. So my last video I was showing you guys what I was working on and so now I want to show you what I created. So these are all the stamps I use. I use mostly these three, the Ice Cream Dream, the Here's My Scoop, and the Treat Yourself uh, by Lawn Fawn, but I also use the You're So Sweet from the Sweet Smiles. And then I use the labels just for you labels and stamp set for the back of my cards which I absolutely love as well as Riley's ABC's and then I also used um, the it's your birthday from year three so I counted up how many images I actually colored and it was 46 so I got 13 cards this is the first one that I did and I absolutely love this so I wanted to make a card that had all of the images on it like all of the different ones that I've colored up so I just laid them across my craft mat and then cut out a card base that would get them all on there so I cut out the ice cream you scream we all scream for ice cream and just put that on there to have the sentiment. I find that sentiment's a bit hard to use unless you're using a square card. And the inside I just put a matching border and I think I'm going to put happy birthday treat yourself but some of them I didn't put inside um, sentiments just yet. Um, but I do plan hopefully on using most of these for birthdays. So that was the first one I made and then this was an eight and a half by eleven piece of white cardstock. So the little piece that was left over made this size of card, so I thought I would just use it instead of putting it in my scraps. And this sentiment says, I love you more than ice cream, that's a lot. And I just stamped a little heart, and then I have the images. And then I had die cut the circle, I thought I was going to use it, and I didn't, so I just put it on the inside. And here's the uh, Just For You labels. So I just used, um, actually that's Heidi Swap Mint Ink. It's the first time I used it. It's really pretty. So there's card number two. Card number three is this one. Uh, all the papers that I used were Dear Lizzie Neapolitan, except for this pink one, which is a Maggie Holmes one. It's the one with the really pretty flowers. Not flowers, hearts. And I just had some scraps, so I just cut a, bander, a banner. That's an Amy Tan die with the heart and I just cut out a little brown heart to go inside there to match the chocolate ice cream and then these are my um, diamond die circles so the inside of that well it says you're so cool you melt my heart and that's lawn fun on the inside so just using some papers to use them up and then I still have room to write a message so card number three card number four and five are similar so I saw someone, I was on Pinterest, and one of the lawnscaping challenges, someone had done the ice cream you scream all in the background as a background stamp, which I thought was really cute. I didn't quite get it lined up, but whatever. So their design was very different, but I did use the back. So that's this one. All you need is ice cream. And then on the inside, I just used the baked brown sugar that's a Stampin' Up! ink pad on the inside. And I haven't written a sentiment yet. And then here's the second one I did because I really liked that design. So you can see they're different, um, but the inside is the same. So cards four and five. Then I also made, I really like this design as well. So I did three of these. So cards six, seven, and eight. And so these two both say treat yourself, this one and this one, and then this one says you're so sweet, and again it says you melt my heart on the inside. So love that one. I don't, oh I put it's your birthday on the inside of that one, and I think the same with this one. Yeah. So card nine, um, using the craft card stock, this one says again, I love you more than ice cream, that's a lot. So this was getting down to kind of my last ones. This image wasn't so great, but it's for an eight-year-old's birthday. So just use um, a scalloped border die from Lawn Fawn with card stock to match the pink, which I think turned out cute. And this one just says happy birthday as well. 
so cute. I had so much fun making these. So here's card 10, which I absolutely adore. This is paper from the Neapolitan line with the ice creams. I thought it was so cute. And I just put a banner on the inside and I haven't stamped anything. Um, that's the same on the back. I do have some that are different. So then I was getting down to the end. So um, 11, 12, and 13 are 3x3 three three cars. So I did this one next, You're So Cool. And this little ice cream is from L'Enfant, but I find it looks weird with the ice cream on it. So I kind of like have it coming off, which also kind of looks a little weird, but I think, I don't know, it's whimsical. So, yeah. So, and then I just put some paper on the inside of this one just to make them a little bit stronger. This one says, here's the scoop. So I had some ice cream cones left. You are so sweet. And then the last one, I had one image left, so I made this little guy. And it says, you're so sweet, and it just has the paper on the inside with the little sundae. So, super um, easy and uh, just cute. Just cute to have on hand when you need something. Um, I just want to show you. So, on the back of these ones, I used this one, which I think is really cute. So those are the Riley ABCs and they fit in there to write your name. And I think I did the same on the back of this one. Yeah, so anyways, thought those were cute. I, like I have, I don't think I've ever made 13 cards in one sitting. So I had so much fun doing these. I think they turned out really, really, really cute. So yeah, so thanks everybody for watching. I hope, uh, you know, this inspires you to get out a stamp set and create. Um, one of the things, I don't know if any of you are watercolors, but one of the things I noticed is it feels really chalky, almost like it's gonna come off. And I don't know if it's because I'm using the back of watercolor paper and so it's not as porous so the paint doesn't seep in or if I'm using too much color and not enough water so if anybody knows can you let me know um, I think it might be a combination of both but I'm not exactly sure so thanks everybody for watching have a great day and I'll see you soon bye